Happy Tuesday. So going your own way, maybe in other words, taking the road less traveled, not doing what you were always told to do, have a family, get a career, you know, whatever. I was talking to a friend of mine about this last night. Because part of me, I'm not where I thought I'd be in my life when I was younger, at the age I am now. And I'm, you know, certainly closer to middle age than ever before. You know, rolling, I'm 46 hard. And, uh, you know, single, no kids. I don't, honestly, don't know if I ever projected or thought about where I'd be at 46. But I certainly thought, you know, when I was older, older, I'd be on a porch drinking Jack Daniels or Crown Royal, and I'd have a bunch of kids, and I'd be a drunk. <laughs> and that's not really on the horizon right now, um, any of it maybe excluding being on a porch in a rocking chair. I feel, you know, I, at some point, I'm changing. I've changed, thank God. I'm in, you know, I don't, I don't for better or for worse, I haven't really planned much beyond this next month. I just haven't. That's fine. Who knows? I'll deal with it when I get there. So my friend and I were talking and, and he's happy and he's kind of going up against some of that stuff himself where he, you know, thinks he should be or where he thought he'd be and where he is, but he's happy as opposed to, you know, when we look over the fence at our, our peers or our friends or our family and what they have or what we think we should have. And that's when we get a little bit conflicted, like, well, maybe I should be over, wait, I'm, you know, and for me, like, I just bring it back to me, like, where am I at? Am I okay? Yes. Am I happy in this moment? Yes. It makes it simpler. I'm grateful and that gets me grounded and anchored. But if I step into this thing, project into my past, jump into my future, I get out of alignment and I get afraid that I'm not going to get what I think I deserve or think I should have or expected to have. And breathe into my truth and walk my path. And that takes some courage, I think. I mean, not blowing my own horn, but I, it took me a long time to be able to like just walk my path and be like, oh, this is my path and that's your path. Awesome. We both have different paths and have compassion and empathy for other people along their path and support them, love them. It's the beauty of living, the beauty of this experience. I don't know, and I love that. Much love.